my fellow gamers and gamers, and welcome to Five Nights at Minecraft. I'm probably wondering why I'm back to um, uh, why does it say remastered like the previous one did? It's because I recently got an email from the developer of the game. He sent this to me saying, hey, we loved your first video, so you need to do play the remastered version. So he sent me the link to download it. Download it. Make a check it to see if it runs. It runs. I haven't gotten into the game because I wanted to see what it was for myself. But um, the screen here is looking really cool. The animatronics are here. They look a lot different than the previous ones do. They were a lot scarier than the last one. Now, will this be scarier? I don't know. Um, it looks really good based on the screen. Um, and you know, obviously, it's a replica of Bucket's Bricks too. And you might be wondering. Why haven't I gotten around to playing this? It's because it came out a little bit. It literally just got released yesterday. I had gotten the word it came out yesterday. I think it came out yesterday. Did it say yesterday? I, I don't know. It was supposed to probably, it was supposed to not even come out yesterday or whenever this dropped. It wasn't even supposed to come out this year. It was supposed to come out next year in celebrate of the, it wasn't even supposed to come out actually here. It was supposed to come out next year for 6th anniversary, the first game and the second. But, you know, some genius decided we should play this, so I'm gonna get into it, see what it's like. Um, so it's gonna be different. We'll notice on the way. Let's see. All right. Vintage Beach Maria, give a new life. Come be a part of the new face party. Guys, first night. What could go wrong? 150. All right. First night. All right. Um, I'm, I got some great potentials to this. All right, what we got? We're just waiting for the office. To <laughs> Oh, wow! Ah, uh, hello. Hello, hello. Ah, uh, hello and welcome to your new summer job at the new and improved Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. I'm here talking through some of the things you can expect to see during your first week here and to help you get started down this new and exciting career path. Uh, now I want you to forget anything you may have heard about the old location, you know, uh, some people may still have a somewhat negative impression of the company. Uh, that old restaurant was kind of left to rot for quite a while. But uh, I want to reassure you, Fazbear Entertainment is committed to family fun and, above all, safety. They spent a small fortune on these new animatronics. Uh, facial recognition, advanced mobility. They even let them walk around during the day. I mean... <laughs> But most importantly, they're all tied into some kind of criminal database so they can detect a predator a mile away. Heck, we should be paying them to guard you. Uh, now that being said, no new system is about its kinks. Uh, you're only the second guard to work at that location. Uh, the first guy finished his week, but complained about conditions. Okay. Uh, we switched him over to the day shift, so hey, lucky you, right? No. Uh, mainly he expressed concern that certain characters seemed to move around at night and even attempted to get into his office. Well, we know that should be impossible. Uh, oh. Restaurants should be the safest place on Earth, so oh, while our engineers don't really have an explanation for this, the working theory is that the robots were never given a proper night mode, so when it gets quiet, they think they're in the wrong room. So then they go try to find where the people are, and in this case, that's your office. So our temporary solution is this. There's a music box over by the prize counter, and it's ready to be, wrapped, to be wound up remotely. So just every once in a while, switch over to the prize counter video feed and wind it up for a few seconds. It doesn't seem to affect all of the animatronics, but it does affect one of them. Uh, and as for the rest of them, we have an even easier solution. Uh, you see, there may be a minor glitch in the system. Something about robots that use an endoskeleton without his costume on, and wanting to stuff you inside a suit. So hey, maybe we can do an empty Freddy Fazbear head. Problem solved. You can put it on any time, leave it on as long as you want. Eventually anything that wandered in, will wander back out. Uh, something else worth mentioning is kind of the modern design of the building. Uh, you may have noticed that there are no doors for you to close. Uh, but hey, you got a light, and even though your flashlight can run out of power, the building can not So don't worry about the place going dark. Well, I think that's about it. Uh, you should be golden. 
check the lights, put the Freddy head on if you need to, uh, keep the music box wound up, be the king. Have a good night. Talk to you tomorrow. Okay. So, this is a great adventure. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. She's not missing a bit. I'm not really scared of her. I have to say, this man's fine. Oh, I put a flashlight for me. A flashlight you want.